Hey, hello and welcome to BJ Vlogs. It's such an honor to come your way. I'm so happy that you always come here to watch my video, share my videos for others to know what we are doing here. Thank you so much. Uh, why you that allow BJ Vlogs? Jintian, uh, what she want? Nimendo, how? Yes, I think you are all doing well. And so I really appreciate Please, if today is your first time, don't forget to subscribe. If you have already subscribed, please don't forget to share for others to enjoy what we are doing here. I'm out here on the streets. Yes, yeah, so those who have watched my other videos, even on the other channel, you realize that there is something that I showed you, especially on how to pick buses here in China, and uh, like the busing system here in China, the transportation system here in China. But this morning, I just want to take you around and see how it's like early morning when Chinese people are rushing to go to school, rushing to go to work and all that. I took this video in vacation period, and so a lot of people are currently not here in Wuhan. Yes, but... We want to see how it is like early morning rush. Realize that in China they have their busing system. Aside the busing system, they have their bicycles, and most of the people use motorbikes, and that is what amazes me. And so I want you to go with me. We'll go out there. You check. You know we have the uh, the, the subways, we have the trains. Yet the number of people who, who use motorbike, it's mind blowing. And I want you to have a look at it. So it's morning and it's rush hour. Realize a lot of people are rushing just to get a bus. Personally, I, I had to park on the way. This is my bike, actually. Yes. So I have to park on the way and then just be here uh, to make this experiment or social experiment for you to know that. Yes. Yeah, so now let's look at the number of people who will be riding bike or motorbikes just past this place and let's see but i'll just go and get you a very good glimpse of how it is like the number of people so you can you can realize that there are a lot of people who are coming here with um, bikes you can just see the number so this is like an early morning rush something in china where a lot of people although takes the their cars their private cars takes the buses but every morning it is something unique that you see here in China so the number of people who use bikes is so mind-blowing and to those who are watching me from Ghana we have Okada system here in China if you don't know I was especially find there because yeah they are all mixed up so I can't really tell where the Okada systems are but like we have Okada people here in China so you can see the number of people who are riding bike past this place and it's so for you to know that a lot of workers even managers and all that because they want to, they don't want to be late to work they would also just get their uh, bikes and everything on. So, let's see. So, you realize that the closest bus stop is just around here. Just around this spot. You can even see from the other side of the road that there is a closest bus stop there. And so, what people do is that as soon as they get down from the bus, looking at uh, what bus stop lies ahead of them, or the number of, uh, how do you call it, uh, the, the heavy flow of traffic in front of them, then they would just get down at the nearest bus stop and then get one of these uh, bicycles to just come in here. So you just continue with any of these bicycles. What you have to do is just to scan the code. Yeah, you just scan the QR code and then you make payment. Uh, maybe 2 UN, yeah, 2 UN, and then you are good to go. So, really, it's, it's a lot, and it's, they are actually parked closer to the bus stops. So, that is it. Now, I want to get a closer shot of, yeah, let me just get a closer shot of. So, I'm not at Guangu. Uh, this is one of the busiest intersection points here in Wuhan. And you realize the number of uh, vehicles or motorbikes that are waiting to go i think this should even be the list maybe i did not come here early but then this should give you an idea of the number of motorbikes people actually use here in china and so in the morning see this is just a morning rush a quick morning rush and it's so mind-blowing such that everybody wants to use bike or motorbike just to get to their destination very early because the traffics are huge and i always say that China has one of the best overhead bridges and a lot of good roads in here. However, in the morning, it is very, very difficult for people to just get to their destination cell because of the number of people who are... You
Yo, so in today's video, this is what and today I didn't have any. Uh, today my ca my cameraman did not come, and so I had to do everything myself. And thank you for subscribing. Thank you for always being with us. If today is your first time, please don't forget to subscribe, share, and like for others to also enjoy what we are doing, and would we'll forever be grateful. Thank you. We want to see this channel grow? Now we are on 316 subscribers. You know, before we were almost at 3,000, 3k. So let us get back to that stage and then yeah but if you are in china you can link up as well if you are now coming to china you can link up as well wherever you are link up and let us just have fun bye, -bye.